see, if you gain access to the Institute's complex, specifically the Synth Retention Bureau's wing, you can find a terminal that lists the number of informants the organization has been working with above ground in the Commonwealth. And among the names is actually oh, Henry Forms, Cook. It's okay. The man has secretly been working with the It's okay, Dave, we need to light on for now. Nothing he says, nor anything we find in the tavern allude to the secret. The only way to uncover it is to access the terminal in the SRB. This is especially telling, considering the huge anti synth and anti institute <laughs> paranoia sweeping Diamond City. If Henry were caught working with them, it surely wouldn't end well for him. Furthermore, that shipment of chems you intercepted were made in a lab owned by a man simply called Morowski, who also owns Good Neighbors Hotel Rexford. And he, too, is cited as an informant by the Institute in the same terminal. It would appear Henry, and even those he works with, are involved in a business far deeper than simply brewing and chem selling. Coming at number three, once the player has surpassed level 30, at an unmarked destroyed building just west of the Corvega assembly plant, there's a small chance of character named no, Goldie. Mario will I'm sorry, sweetie, you can't dig it, though. Small army of rad it won't dig but out. But yet I'm at the couch, not a little bit, because that's whose paw that is. I keep slapping around. However, they will all be hostile No, he's actually where he's not supposed to be. It's just funny, though. Now, once they spotted you, the ensuing fight will be quite a challenging one. As Reggie spawns in as a legendary enemy. I know, it's frustrating, isn't it? It's frustrating, isn't it? You can't get that paw that keeps coming out there. So hold on. It'll be out again. Forms, be good. Maybe he got out. Still under there? Yep, you are. Kind of like noodling for catfish, except I'm noodling for a cat. Noodling for a cat paw. Just like Fallout 4's Reggie Blataria, the Roach King would also wield a minigun and be very hostile. From the looks of it, it seems as though Fallout 3's Roach King has a disciple in the Commonwealth. Southeast of Mass Gravel and Sand in Cambridge, the player can find the ruins of what appears to have at one point been an ordinary pre-war plumbing and Yeah, it's she's still, or he's still there. You'll find it's and she's still interested. Even by Fallout standards. Within the building, you coming back to find him? Huh? You coming back to find him? A lot of mud clots around here. They just came in from outside and just sweep up. Looks like he may have retired from the game for right now. Thank you for tuning in to another episode of The Paw from Beneath the Couch.